So my daughter and I um, decided we, last year we were going to go ahead. We had a little bit of a housing change at the beginning of last year. And we had always wanted to do van life, bus life. So we went ahead and found the bus and um, built it out. And then we left in December. And it's not fully done, but we're finishing as we go. That's always the way. Yeah, and so far it's been amazing. It has been one of the best things ever. So we came out to Schoolie Palooza, and this has been an awesome experience. Good, and I mean yeah. it's just starting. Right, I know. That's what this is like day three for us. So she is even not even here. I mean, she's off with kids. There's so many. All hanging things. out. It's been amazing. Yeah. Where did you find the bus? If you don't mind uh, me asking. Utah. It was actually a um, a Head Start bus from a local college. So it had already come painted. The paint oh, wow. is super worn off. In fact, I forgot to do the sun, but it's got the ocean on one side, um, it's mountains on the other side, and then it's kind of funky in the front, and we just went ahead and touched it up and went with that, and finish, figure we'll finish it as we go. So, yeah. That's so a good plan. It's super functional, and yeah. Take Might if we have a you. peek inside? Absolutely. And pardon the dust and the clutter. That's okay. Thanks for having us. Yes, no, absolutely. Oh wow. So this is really just, nice. Yeah, just the the two of us. Um, I built it out myself. In fact, when I started, I didn't even know how to build a box, and I started with the toilet. So this thing's huge. Uh, we'll eventually change it out to a smaller type composting, but it, it is a separating composting toilet. And I haven't finished my plumbing, but we will have a little trough tub to do our showering off in. I've got my hot water heater there. And then obviously we've got a full queen that does pull up into two beds. But until I get more shelves built, I've got a lot of stuff down there. And my cooler can't quite go where I had planned for it. But I do have a fridge freezer. Nice. So yeah, I can have ice cream in the desert. And I run a huge solar, believe it or not, off this little tiny thing that was more expensive than the bus. <laughs> Sometimes that's the yeah. way. Yeah. But if you've got plenty of power, you know, there's something to be said That's for that. That's what I figured it. It has everything we need. So, um, it's been amazing. I don't know that we'll go back. To and you've been doing it for how long? Just since December 1st, since we left. We've been on it, though, full time since August. So, I was still building and finishing stuff before we could get bolted down and on the road. And it took me a little bit longer than I had planned. That's okay. you got floor but, in. Yes. You've got a regular... Oven, Oven and yes. stove, yep. and that's running off the propane. It is. Yep. Did you have to change it over, or did it was it already? I, uh, nope. It. I didn't change it over. It was already. So I just plumbed it and ran it out the back for right now, and then I'm going to build a little shelf once I can get a little bit of welding skill or find somebody to teach me because that's. Right on. I want to learn how to do all of that, including the maintenance on the bus. That's the, been the big, you know, the big thing is making sure I know how to change the oil. And right. What is it? It's What's a the engine? Simple. This is the simple Chevy gas. I'm a 5.7 liter 350. Um, probably one of the most simple van type engines to change. So, yeah, I just kind of keep everything stocked on board so that we're, in case of an emergency, we're hopefully stocked and ready. And look at how much room and bright and yes. open it is in here. Yeah. Some people will put shelves up, which it gives them the storage, but right. you're just so confined. Yep. And in here, you've got the light coming in. Oh, it's, yeah. a, it's a sunny day. You even put a fan in. Yep. Did you cut the hole for this fan, or was there something here from the school? I did have somebody help me cut that. Um, but yeah, we got that cut in, and it. I did go with the remote control um, option on that Max fan, and I love that. So you can set it to temperature control and it just automatically opens and then sucks all your hot air out or pushes your cold air in. Right. Yeah. There's a couple things I was pretty picky on that I wanted and then the rest of it I just went with. I got recycled items from places and made it work. It looks and great. how to build a cabinet. I so. think it kind of fits better that you've got recycled items yeah. in here because it fits the whole vibe magnet everything in this bus even my <laughs> everything that's funny. our butterflies everything is magnet in here did you paint the ceiling or was it no, already it came painted too and that's why i did not want to take it off and replace it i wanted to stick with it and just yeah we'll deal with the heat eventually so what happens after schoolie palooza for you guys 
Um, we're deciding right now if we're gonna head out to Florida. There's uh, kind of a meetup out there you need to register for, but we've been told about that. It's another schoolie meetup, or uh, we might stay and do all the hot springs in Arizona, or head back and go up the one. I'm not sure up the 101 all the way up the west coast. Right. Our passports did just arrive, so we might look for a caravan and go down into Mexico. There's a lot of options. Yeah, Those are like all going to take options. place. It's just a matter of which is going to come first. Right. So, yeah. So, so far it's been amazing. I'm Tamara and my daughter's Kylie and we're the Magic Plus in Us. We have an Instagram handle and a YouTube. Not okay. too much on the YouTube, but yeah. Okay. Mostly on Instagram. Well, we'll get you on Instagram and start Absolutely. following you. Awesome. Sounds fun. Thanks so much. All right. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. If you'd like to see more videos like that, I've got my 10 best right up here. If you'd like to consider becoming a patron, I've got the link for that right here. And finally, become a subscriber and hit the bell notification so you can be notified when more videos like this come out. Thanks. See ya.